And as Jigawa State begins to experience rainfall as predicted uh, in 2024, the state government has allocated millions of naira for purchase of emergency items and relief materials. This is coming after heavy rainfall washed away many farms in Guaram, Buji, and Garki local government areas. The Jigawa State Emergency Management Agency has also assured that it's well prepared to handle the situation and it's closely monitoring developments in all the 27 local government areas. According to the Executive Secretary of the agency, Haruna Meriga uh, Sema has procured essential items to support affected communities. The motive behind this uh, workshop is just to mitigate, prepare, and prevent all those disasters that have been happening here in Chikawa. And at the same time, if you look at this critically, you will now get to understand that disaster management is everybody's affairs. And as far as that case is concerned, we NEMA particularly, we don't wait for disaster to occur. Uh, you see drainages filling with leather and what have you. All the substance that doesn't normally decay or decompose, uh, making problem to uh, some of the gutters we have in the city. If evacuated, we need to, if desilted, we evacuate it. Yes, we evacuate the debris. So this is what we are, do, we are, we are doing. And the, in the issue of our solid waste management is one of the critical issues because, you know, whenever there is population, then waste is being generated. So the GSEPA, we are evacuating this waste and uh, we are sensitizing public to ensure that they manage the waste. The waste should be taken to the appropriate place to be dumped. In a proactive move to mitigate the impact of predicted flooding in Jigawa State, the National Emergency Management Agency, Kano 